Hi, this is the second video of the network attack and this video I'm going to teach you how to intercept traffic with Wireshark and what you're going to learn about this you, get, you, you will get acquainted for the Wireshark and intercepting traffic with WS also you will get to snip your credentials using the WS or the Wireshark so I want you to go into the application Sniffing and spoofing and open Wireshark. And as for um, as for myself, yeah, I've already opened the Wireshark. This is what you're going to see after clicking it. And then let's get started. So after you start it, you you will see the blue one with that I think it's a shark something. So just start click it. Start after you start clicking it minimize and then i want you to open the firefox firefox browser and input the exploitable ip address let's wait for a while please bear with this one. As, I, as, as you can see the, in the video last time, on the first video, um, my PC is very, very, really very slow. I'm using a 4GB RAM and also an A10, AMD A10. This is not really good for ethical hacking, but what can I do? I don't have anything yet. So later on, maybe I'm going to buy a laptop much more speed and much more high specs than this one there so well don't forget to subscribe and share and follow my videos in the YouTube and then if you want to ask more and you want to learn more and want some ideas please don't forget to please don't forget to add my page on the on Facebook BM Cyber Awareness, I own that page and I am the one who's posting some knowledgeable ideas. So in the browser, you're going to input the IP address of the Kali app, uh, the Metasploitable 2, it's 192.168.134.121. Seriously. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm very very sorry for this. 192 68 point Six eight. Oh my God! Why so loud? Point one three four one two nine. Yes, and then hit enter. Wow, four thousand years. Click DB DBWA. And then just input anything, uh, for example, BM Cyber Awareness, and the password is I'm so lag. So let's assume that I do not know the password. So input, uh, start login. Don't save the password. Of course, we don't know the password and the username for that. We're just going to try if you can. We can get the credentials. So let's get back to the Wireshark. And then stop. Input this in the search bar. Oh my god. Stop. And then on the search bar, please input this one. Frame contains password. 
and hit enter all right so you will see the in here the number the time the source the most important is the destination if you see the the ip address of the destination is 129 then that is the target's ip address then you need to click that right click follow http stream And there you are. You will see that the username I input is BM Cyber Awareness, and the password is I'm so lag. So we assume that we don't know the password that the user inputted, but as just to confirm it, I I, I input the I'm so lag, and then we have confirmed it in here that I'm so lag is the real password, and the username is the BM Cyber Awareness. So. That's all for the Wireshark and in the advanced lesson, maybe this will take time because we're still in the very basic or from the scratch. I'm going to teach you much more advanced later on. Just don't forget to subscribe and share this on how uh, so for that anyone could understand and learn about this. So this is the step by step tutorial about Wireshark, uh, Wireshark the basic. So let's get started with the another video about network attack.